Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. I'm the Handbag Fanatic and today I would like to share with you two items that I picked up from the recent coat drop that they had on the outlet. So I was able to grab two items. Um, what When I woke up, almost everything else was sold out. So I was able to grab these two items. So I want to share them with you and I'm going to start with this one here. So you, as you can see, it's black. So I'm going to, it's, you know, of, of course, you know, it's not going to be a true unboxing. I already took them out of the box, but, and I already took a peek. So I'm just going to share with you what they are. So this first one is, um, is the coach Mickey Mouse Dinky in the smooth leather, black with smooth leather. Let me put the camera down a little bit. So it's the Coach Mickey Mouse in the black and it's still wrapped up very nicely. Came really, really packaged, wrapped up nicely. And it's the very pretty, very pretty color on inside. And um, let me move it closer so you can see it. It's Mickey Mouse, smooth leather, dinky. It's wrapped up nicely and this was retailed for 395 and in US dollars see the pretty 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 threads I love the pretty threads that they um the thread matches the color on the inside perfectly it's very pretty very nice very nicely packaged everything is packaged nicely and looks awesome and I could already see that it comes with this 1941 dust bag that I love. I love these 1941 dust bag that they they have with these dinkies. So I'm not going to go in too much details because there's a lot of dinky um, videos. And it's not really a new style. So I'm not going to go in a lot of details. But let me know if you want to see anything else does have a back pocket so it has a back pocket right here um i'm just going to show you a little bit have the back the pocket right there um like i said not too much details does have the main compartment right there does have that other compartment right here and has sort of should i say a gusset yeah so it does have you know, it's not it's not a big bag. It's a pretty small bag. So that is the first item that I received. Let me put it over here. So the second item that I received is in pink, and it's also a dinky. But this one is actually in. It's pink, and it's actually in pebble leather. It's not in smooth leather like the black one. And this is the Dink, the Daisy Dinky. So this is the, also the Disney collection. If you can see here, it's uh, the Daisy, Daisy Dinky. And this one was also retailed for $395 and is pack, packaged nicely as well. Um, so these bags like i said these bags um they're not new style but i absolutely love them and the color on the inside uh, i think the color on the inside i don't know if it's ox blood but my older dinky my older dinky is also in the same color which I'm starting when I do it like when I put them like this this look a little bit lighter this is a little bit darker than than the older I shouldn't say, well the dinky I had before the one I already had so that now I have three dinkies and I want to show you I also want to show you this uh, dinky is in powder pink. So this is the powder pink color. 
Dinky. And I have to show you, this is my Carnation wallet. And I realized that they match really, really well. The Carnation wallet and the Dinky is almost a perfect match. Of course, you know, one is smooth leather and one is in the pebble leather. But I think they match really, really well. So I want to compare the powder pink with the candy pink because my swinger is candy pink and the uh, dinky is powder pink. So the candy pink is just a tad bit um, darker. I wouldn't say it's like super darker, but it's, it's, it's a, you know, it's a little darker. Um, the candy, so this is candy pink and this is powder pink and the, it's, it's a little darker. As you remember from my last video or a few videos ago, I I had this wallet that I show you that matches perfectly. And now I have this one that matches this daisy this daisy um dinky so i'm i'm one thinking guys i don't know because i do have my dinky the first one that I already had i do have this one and it's actually it's a smaller bag and you know how crazy i went to get this bag so i don't know if i want to keep all three so if you my concern is with the black one my concern is it already has quite a few like dings on it if you could see that has a little dings some little dings on it and it did and and has like i think it's the way they store it it has some marks on it i don't think it's a scratch but i think it's from storage so my concern is if I keep this dinky, the black one, there's a whole bunch of little bubbles. I don't know if you could see them. Little imperfection in the leather. And I'm not really concerned about imperfection in the leather. It's just I'm concerned more about how scratched up it's going to get because of smooth leather. Um, that's my only concern is the scratch and how bad it's going to look within a short period of time. Because I do have, what I'm carrying right now is my Cassie. And this is a signature Cassie. And if you see, there's so much scratches on this bag. From just everyday wear and tear. You know, just from carrying this bag out. Putting in my car, grabbing it out the car. There's so much little scratches on this bag. That's my concern with smooth leather. Um, but I don't have a problem with this, even though with this, this is the pebble leather. I don't have too much of a problem with the pebble leather because it doesn't really get scratched up like that. I, but I, the, my issue is I do like the black one more than I like this one. So I don't know my, which, you know, I don't know if I should, what I should do when it comes to keeping one and sending one back. I don't know what I should do. I'm very confused at this point, but I do like both of the bags. I do like both of these bags very much. Um, I should say all three of these, all of my bags. I love all my bags. So I'm very confused as if I should keep them or I should return one and which one I should keep. So let me know what you think. Um about these bags so there was a lot of people on my facebook group that missed the drop and they were going crazy trying to get one of these bags and i got the bag and i'm complaining about which one i want to keep and which one i want to send back um i probably should ask someone if they if when i make my decision i'll see if in case in, you know instead of sending the bag back if i should ask someone if they would like the bag instead but I will see what I decide and then I'll let you know because these bags are really not really nice the, the leather is so soft on these bags it is so soft guys I don't know it just feels magical <laughs> basically the leather feels 
really really good on all three of these bags on the inside i don't know what kind of leather they use on the inside but the leather on the inside is much different from the leather on the outside and the leather on the inside is super soft it's butter it's buttery soft basically really really soft really nice leather on the inside and i'm just saying if all three bags have the same nope this leather is a little bit different this leather is more wrinkly and it's not as soft as the other two that i that i just showed you so this leather is not really that soft however i feel like the leather on the inside is more durable than the leather on the outside which is kind of crazy to me because this is going to get scratched up and the leather on the inside is just going to be super durable because it's ring is more wrinkly which i like i like it like the wrinkly leather i feel like it's not going to get scratched up that much it's almost feel like it's i, I would say almost because it doesn't almost feel like pebble leather almost like a very very finer grain pebble leather so and i love like i said i love this black one i love the look of it i love the thread i love the black the, the this color against the black it is absolutely gorgeous and i absolutely love this one i love this one as well but you know my concern when it comes to darker hardware it's a smaller bag so i'm not really too concerned about the hardware when it comes to smaller bags i just feel like it is what it is it's a small bag and it doesn't have that much hardware so i'm not too concerned but i will let you know when i decide because i do love these bags and i will figure it out and i'll let you i'll come back and let you know on another video so i would like to say thank you so much for watching my video i appreciate all of you guys and i'm gonna get out of here right now and i really hope you enjoy this video and i'll see you in the next one Bye.